Okay, starting off with Kat Von D ink liner in Bukowski. It's this like nice emerald green shade. I'm applying that to my brows. It looks crazy right now, but it won't be in a second. Next, taking Kat Von D ink liner in Bosch and continuing to flick in some hair like strokes. First taking NYX HD Concealer in Fair with a Sigma F75 brush. Then pulling that product down. And then I'm gonna blend that out with my e.l.f. Flawless Concealer Brush. Next, taking my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the color Fair, applying that to the top of my brow. Using an Eco Tools concealer brush. Starting on the tail. And then where I've flicked in some hair like strokes, I'm gonna turn my brush vertically, kind of mimic that. Blend that out. Then I will go back in with the Bosch ink liner and just go back over some of those hair like strokes. Next, to prime my eye, I'm taking Kat Von D High Voltage Eye Primer. Applying that all over my lid, my finger. And then setting that with MAC Long Type. First, starting off with Makeup Forever M860 shadow. With my MAC 224 brush, I will apply that to the upper crease area as my transition shade. I have not decided what I'm doing yet, but apparently I want to use pink, so I guess we'll find out. Next, just taking Riki Riki from the Suva Beauty palette. And then taking the coconut shade as well to help blend that out. Next, taking Destroyer from my Kat Von D Maybe to Loca palette and a Zoeva 227 brush. I'm going to apply that. Then blending that out. So next, taking the shade Denaru from my Suva Beauty Palette, I'm going to apply that to the direct crease area with a Zoeva 231 brush. And then taking more of the Destroyer shade to help blend that together. Next, I'm going to highlight my brow bone with the shade Skulls. And next, taking the shade Rewind from my Kat Von D Me Vita Loca palette with the Zoeva 231 brush and applying that to the outer V.
Next, I'm gonna take concealer and a small brush to cut my crease. I'm using a Real Techniques detailer brush. Now I'm going to blend it out with my finger. It kind of looks like Christmas right now. Now that I have my lid blocked out, I'm going to apply this tangerine shadow from this brand called The Body Needs with a flat pink brush, which I'm going to spray with Fix Plus and apply this color to the inner third area. And next I'm gonna take this pink color called Shameless from Wildly Natural Cosmetics and apply that to the center of my lid. You can use my code BECCA at their website to get 10% off your order. And these pigments are amazing. They're really beautiful. Now I'm just gonna take more of that tangerine shadow and go over that transition there. And we're going to wing this out. So starting on the outer corner of the eye, going to flick it up and then we're going to pull this back. And fill this in. Okay, now that I have my wing done, I'm going to apply concealer on my under eyes and clean up this wing here. Blend that out. Tap over this with my finger. Have to fix the tail right here. Taking my Sigma E36 and the shade Skulls again, we're going to apply that to my inner corner, kind of blending it around. And on top of that, I just want to put some of the shade Legend. And for this, I'm just taking a pencil brush and then laying that out a little bit. I will take a Sigma E25 brush and the shade Vinyl and apply that to my lower lash line. The shade Misfit, the Weva 231, and applying that right here. We're going to go with the Hyper Ballad. Apply it right there to the outer corner of the lower lash line. Show you guys how I did that one time, how I did like the dots feeding out of my wing. So first I'm gonna take the Kat Von D Trooper Tattoo Liner, Bosch, Dally, and Bukowski. 
And starting off with the black, I'm going to do a few dots around it. So then taking the Bukowski. Next, taking the Dali. And last, taking Bosch. I just want to go back in with the black. But this time I'm going to take Sephora Collection, a little black dress liner. Oh, actually, I'm going to add some of the Neruda too. You can dot this one. These are House of Lashes Noir Fairy in Black. I'm going to pop this on. 